idea of what goes on in these factory farms and the undercover investigators are the ones who bring it to light and we need them so desperately, the animals need them. We are setting new precedent for what compassion means, we are setting new precedent for what environmentalism means, for what humanism means, and for what love means. And to me, that's the most significant work a human can do. Yeah. So, <laughs> new legal precedent, like the one we set in Rayford, North Carolina, the first ever felony conviction for cruelty towards birds, which gets all the And also cultural precedent, like when companies such as Walmart, as in Walmart, uh, can <laughs> adopt new sweeping corporate policies that previously were absolutely unmentionable. That to me is truly groundbreaking. It is now dumping one of the companies. Most like Kroger have stopped buying from the farm in question. Costco announces it will cut ties with that farm. We all, we all like to live dangerously, so we're always on the edge. Uh, one, one really great thing for us to be here today is that, you guys probably don't know, but we actually don't get to ever hang out together. And a lot of us have talked through email, have talked on the phone, but we actually never met in person. Looking back, I think I have always been acutely aware of the suffering of others. I was generally the kid that was bullied, and my best friends were always my animals. My best friend was the family golden retriever. He's the one that taught me how sensitive and intelligent and playful animals could be. I was able to relate to animals that were abused or that were neglected, and naturally I decided I wanted to spend my life protecting them. So for us to be here today together celebrating with everybody, it's just, it kicks ass. It's so awesome. Thank you, Nathan.